Well, hello all my brothers and sisters. Anyways, today is another day where the sky looks all beautiful, but they're working their magic with the poison in the air. Anyways, I just wanted to let everybody know that, um, well, I went to Columbus to the endocrinologist who specializes in the endocrine system. And so I got it all paid for financially. And first, right off the bat, the doctor comes in the room and he says, we're not going to do surgery on this tumor because we usually have to take out the whole adrenal gland. Well... This adrenaline gland tumor is only 1.4 centimeters. Well, it's been like that for two and a half years. Hell, they've told me one centimeter, two centimeters, 1.8. Now it's 1.4. So I don't know really what the size of this tumor is. I know I'm sick. I know my stomach feels like razor blades. I'm 41 years old. I used to be in perfect health till the last few years. Um... Uh -oh. So, he does uh, some of these tests. One of the tests he did three times. Three. And it was the most important test out of all of the tests. So, I asked him. I asked him, so the first two tests that you took were the results for them. Oh, the blood wasn't drawn right. Or, oh, it's not forming the hemoglobin in it right. Anyways, so he right off the bat in the very beginning, we're not going to do this surgery and take this tumor out, regardless of how sick I am or had a total hysterectomy, almost bled to death. And then I find out that I have a tumor inside my liver. Well, when I researched that, come to find out... An overactive adrenaline gland tumor can cause tumors and lesions inside your liver. So, you know, I've messaged him back in Columbus and no response. So I've come to the conclusion that, you know, I, I guess they want us to be sick and die, which is fine, whatever. It is what it is. So I've been taking it upon myself. I've been doing the natural herbs and things. And so I'm doing the turmeric and curry with the vegetables. And that really helps. Gets a lot of toxins out of the body and things like that. And anyways, cops are rolling around the neighborhood while I'm filming this. I will get back with you all. Let me get off of here and walk down the road and I'll finish this conversation here in a minute I love all of you all and I want to thank thank um, 